the opener nerves you know not nerves but excitement you ready to go i mean how oh, yeah. do you feel to get back out here for sure i was i was really excited i was i was so happy to get back into football it was it's just i love the team you know it's, it's just great i love being out here with them how about yeah. defensively i mean Def that, oh defensively that's your side of the ball yeah 100 right? right. defensively we wanted, we wanted we wanted to uh, we wanted to uh, spill and pry when they pulled their guards so so that our outside linebackers could have a chance to tackle and and a lot of counters, just, right? Yeah, so, yeah, a lot of counters. And we just wanted to play bully ball on defense. Okay. Did you, know? you feel you got that done? Or? Yeah, we got we got it done. Yeah. I feel like it. Okay. How does this one feel tonight? I mean, it feels great. Different team than last year, and we just came with the same energy that we did last year, and we, we're bringing it back. Coach has mentioned how many skill players, a lot of options. So. Yeah. And the key to that is being unselfish. Mm -hmm. You guys feel as a unit pretty cool about that? Like, yeah. you know, you had a good night, you know, next week it's Jackson maybe. Yeah. Or, yeah. You guys cool sharing it a ball? Totally, yeah. It's, it's all about just having different weapons, and it, defenses can't cover us with all the weapons that we have. What was the goal tonight on offense? Uh, what did you guys want to establish? Uh, we just wanted to be able to just run through our plays and, like, get our rhythm and um, just improve every week. And last question, um, offensive line is pretty new in terms of experience and stuff. And it, you know, obviously you know they're important. So how did you feel that rhythm, that whole thing going tonight with that new unit? I think that it went very well other than that one drive that we kind of we kind of uh, got a lot of penalties on that one drive. But other than that, we found our rhythm and uh, we were just able to put points up on the board because of the big men up front. That's got to be encouraging if you're, if you're clicking like that in week one. Yeah, it really is. I first saw an offensive line. Thoughts there? I mean, yeah. it's a whole new thing coming yeah. in. You don't really know until you get the whistles. And oh, we don't really know until we watch the film. <laughs> but, uh, you know, sometimes skilled players make linemen look good. But I, I think just the first impression, I mean, we move the ball that efficiently, the offensive line is doing something right. So uh, very pleased with that. Yep. And the skill guys came through. I mean, you had so many options. Yeah. I mean, we, we kind of knew that coming in. We have some really, really talented kids. Uh, some that didn't even touch the ball tonight. And, um, you know, some guys shot, like Elliot Morgan obviously had an incredible game. Next game, it might be somebody else. Yeah. And, and to have that luxury, and the key to that is un unselfishness, though. They, they love watching each other make big plays, and it's fun to coach. Would it, um, could you get a little more detail on offensive line and your first impressions? I mean, you thought they did well, but... Sure, yeah. Uh, it's tough to say, but, I mean, we ran the ball pretty efficiently. Um, and as I said, to be able to do that, you get some push. And, and, and uh, I, was, I was very pleased with that for, from guys that have not a lot of experience. Or the only one guy has some experience on that line. And yeah. um, they came in and they played well. So far, so good. Yeah. Um, Listen, they're two-time section champs for a reason. You know what I mean? They're well-coached. Their technique and their, their form is unbelievable. They weren't the biggest team. No. They weren't the fastest team. But they're a machine, man. They got a, they got a, a program year after year after year. And the culture that's built, and it's uh, unbelievable. They, they kicked our butts. Plain and simple. Okay, I mean, I... They kicked <laughs> our butts. All over the field. From a coach's perspective, I mean, is that, I mean you're looking at everything here. Outside, split wide. You're looking at interior stuff. Did yep. you find anything? I that thought. Was I thought interior. We we blocked some plays. Okay. Um, listen, we got a ninth grade quarterback. This was going to be expected. Mm -hmm. Like we're throwing a lot at him. The kid's going to be. I'm telling you, he's really good. Yeah. He made a lot of good plays, but then he also made mistakes. So I knew that was going to happen. And the good thing about this year is everybody makes sections. So Great. here's another thing that that didn't help us. They added a game, but yes, they took. They took a week away, and then they took the scrimmage away. Yeah. That is tough in our program. So, listen, I just told them to go out there. I wanted to see how we would uh, handle adversity, and I thought we handled it okay. You know, that was, that was, it was a perfect opportunity to coach that. Like, hey, just go out there and keep fighting. Um, we need to play way tougher. We need to be more violent and physical. They were violent and physical. When they hit you, you felt it. Um, so we need to get there. Listen, I think we will. I think there's a lot of potential. I think this, this group is a good group to coach. I think they're coachable. Um, unfortunately, we, we ran into a powerhouse in, in week one, and we didn't have enough time to prepare. That's, that's what it comes down to.